We're standing on one of the most iconic studio lots in the entire world and we're about to take the Warner Brothers VIP studio tour. I am so excited. I've been asked to wait for a bat tram. A bat tram. Oh my God. How you doing? John, is it? It is. Steven, very nice to meet you. Hop in, let's go. And we're off. All right. And then, John, where are we? So right now, we're on Hennessy Street. It's one of our 10 back lot sets here at Warner Brothers Studios. And it's one of the older sets. They built it in the 1930s. Yeah. Like this played Gotham City for three Batman movies. What? If you're a fan of Friends, you like Friends, I'm right? Really, who isn't a fan of Friends? I know. Yeah. Uh, this is New York City for Friends. They did 10 seasons. They didn't film in New York. They filmed it all right At here. At all? Not a single scene, just establishing shots. That's all. It was absolutely crazy. Sony rented out our back lot to yeah. do the upside down kiss from Spider-Man here. What? Like right on, here? Right on your right side, right here. Oh my God. <laughs> We're right here in the Warner Museum, uh, which so many people can come to. Everybody can come here, which is the amazing thing. It, it really is. And one of the biggest reasons why we're so excited about it is because it's the first time we've ever had all of our Batman movies on display in the same place which at the same time. why I'm geeking out like crazy right now. This is, you. of course, the, the Dark Knight suit. This is the Christian Bale suit. That's exactly right. You see this suit in this case in The Dark Knight Rises. This was Joel Schumacher's first movie with the Batman franchise, Batman Forever. Yes, amazing. I always loved the Riddler suit. I just love Jim Carrey in general, so <laughs> <laughs> always gonna win it over. It all started with us with this one right here. This is the original. That is the 1989 Michael Keaton bat suit. What? Oh my God. We never got a good look at this until we mm -hmm. came here and you could get this close to it. Yeah. And if you pan down to his shoes, he's wearing Nikes. Oh my God. Anytime you go back and you watch Batman and he's running through the streets of Gotham, he's got his wearing Nikes Wearing his Nike on. Airs. <laughs> They're all fully functioning. None of these are replicas. Take a left. Yeah. And open your eyes. Oh my God. I know. Uh, I can't even drive. <laughs> Loads of these things can be fired up. They are oh, actually yeah. fully working vehicles. Right now. So everything in here is an original that they built and used for the films, and they're all, they stay fully functioning vehicles. We're here in the Harry Potter room. Absolutely. So Amazing. it's, again, all authentic costumes and props, concept art from the Harry Potter franchise, most successful film franchise in film history. Really? Right. Yes. Oh my God. No visit to the Harry Potter exhibit is complete without finding out what house you belong in by using the one and only sorting hat. What? I think I'm gonna sit down there and I'm gonna get Hufflepuff and it's gonna be like, where shall I put you? Hufflepuff. No! <laughs> See? This looks like a second-hand store or something. <laughs> That's a really good way to put it. Yeah, this is the Warner Brothers prop house. Uh, it's arguably the largest prop house in the world. It is about 247,000 square feet of props, just four stories of stuff. Amazing, and you just kind of look around and you do recognize things oh, like yeah. this. Oh my God. I couldn't agree more with that reaction. <laughs> it's so true. So these are the chairs that Neo and Morpheus sit in when they are in the Matrix talking about what the Matrix is. How are you not tempted to take things home? I am something. <laughs> it's a discipline, you know? All right, I want you to open this door. This I is your big reveal for your big show. Are you ready? Oh my God. Welcome home. I feel like I'm at home. I know. Smell again. What are they feeling you? John, I have to say thank you so much for showing us around today. It's been Thank you very much for coming and, uh, and hanging out with us. It's been one of the best days of my life, I'm not gonna lie, especially since it ends right here. I think we just need a coffee at this stage. Let's come into it. it.